Okay, our third race here from uh, Chepstow is the ISF Novice Chase, a very small field here. So number one is Lizard Point, Carl Arrogante. Two is Torfian Street for D. Thompson. Three is Armed Warrior Leon Van Rensburg. Four is Insomnia Moilet Surfer. Five is Ride On Pony Martin Leadham. And six, Winterport for Jim Murray. So over this two and a half mile chase course here, there's only six. One of them might not get any money, but you never know if they all stay on their feet. They're quite a fair pace, and it's Lizard Point for Carl Arrogante that takes it, the first, and leads by a couple of lengths. And we've been followed through by Ride on Pony for Martin Leadham. And we've got Insomnia for Moilitz. Armed Warrior for Leon. And they will take the second. And they've got Torfian Street for D. Thompson. And have I missed anybody out? I have. Winterport for Jim Murray. So there's the six. And they approach the third. It's a ditch, a really big fast jump there by Lizard Point. They're still bowling along. But Lizard Point into the fourth. Didn't take that plain one as well as the ditch. But it's Lizard Point that leads by five to Winterport Insomnia together. And then we've got the favourite ride on pony for Martin Leader. Yeah, so that is Torfian Street. On a poor jump there by Winterport. Went through the top of it. And then we've got Armed Warrior by Leon Van Rensburg. <clears throat> In fact, I might have that wrong. I'm not sure if that is a Leon Van Rensburg horse. Apologies if I am calling that one wrong. Armed Warrior. Uh, I think I'm pretty sure I'm right. So anyway, they go past the grandstand and the finishing post. The complete circuit here at Chepstow. And still another uh, 11 fences to get over. But it's Lizard's point. Jockey having a little bit of a rest. May have let him run off a little bit freely here. Because he's got uh, probably a 6-7 length advantage over Winterport in second. Insomnia against the fence in the black and gold and red silks. In between those is Armed Warrior. The two at the rear at the moment are Torfian Street and Ride on Pony, but there's nothing between the chasing pack of five. It's, they've just allowed Lizard Point to go bowling up. They go uphill here at Chepster. Chepstow? Chepster? Where's that? It's probably near Chepstow. So it's still Lizard Point. Leads them into the six. Takes it well. Let's do the rest of the pack. Although his lead's shortening a little bit now as the jockey's starting to take a little pull. Oh, and we've lost one there. Torfian Street for D. Thompson's gone. Bad luck for connections there. Dove right into that one. They're over eight now. There's only five of them left. Which means they're all going to be in the money if they can stay on their feet. But it's still Lizard Point. And another plain one. It's over it well. And followed through probably by five to six lengths to Insomnia. Winterport, Ride on Pony, and Armed Warrior. We'll all start to stalk Lizard Point at some short, but oh, they were very, all very slow at the rear there. Lizard Point, the only one that got over that well. We've got a mile left to travel. And still Lizard Point. Going to try and make every post a winning one. Although Insomnia jumped that one better. Got himself second on, the, on his own. And there's Winterport on the outside. Ride on Pony, Armed Warrior. So it's Lizard Point. His lead being cut back slowly by little by little it's Lizard Point from Ride on Pony that sticks his neck out now for Martin Leader, favourite for the race the inside of that is Insomnia and the outside is Winter Port, Armed Warrior still having a dream ride round very quiet but the lead's been cut now that's to, by a couple of lengths Lizard Point's jockey starts to bustle him along trying to maintain the lead we've only got five furlongs left to run the one just looming on the outside is Ride on Pony and they've been followed through by Winterport Insomnia and Armed Warrior. They go to the 12th. Everybody gets over it. Winterport was slow. Lizard Point still leads, but on the outside is Ride on Pony. Out of the pack comes Winterport to challenge, as does Insomnia. Armed Warrior needs a little bit more. A few sticky jumps there, and Lizard Point still leads. But here comes Wizard Port for Jim Murray. It's Lizard Point and Wizard Winterport. Wizard Port. Winterport and Lizard Point. Winterport takes the jump. Doesn't know if anything left with Lizard Point now. We've got two and a half furlongs left to run. It's Winter Port from Ride on Pony. Lizard Point, Insomnia, plugging on his armed warrior. Ride on Pony jumped that better than Winter Port, and he's got a half a length advantage at the moment. We've only got one and a half furlongs left to run. They go, they're go. they approaching the last. They're all over it. Winter Port still leads from Ride on Pony. It's these two neck and neck. Nothing else is going to win this. We're inside the final furlong. Winter Port just knows in front. When comes Ride on Pony fighting back on the inside, but Winter Port just pulling away now. Just got a little bit left in the tank. Winterport's going to win this actually by about two to three lengths for Jim Murray. So the ISF novice chase goes to Jim Murray with Winterport. Second was right on Ponyford. Martin Leader. 
Third was Insomnia for Moilet Surfer. Fourth was Armed Warrior for Leon Van Rensburg. And Liz Point, now long-time leader for Carl Arrogante, picks up the fifth-place prize pot money.